Hello, in this video I have something interesting. This is my first uh, CNC machine. I always wanted a CNC but uh, they were so expensive. But a month ago I find this CNC online. I find that many people have this CNC and they are very they are pretty happy with it. Uh, best thing about this device is price. I paid this CNC less than $170 with shipping included. You can check description, uh, buying link is there. So this is 3018 CNC. It is small machine, working area is uh, 340 by 160 by 40 millimeters Z axis. Don't expect to cut metal with this machine, but it will be enough for engraving and carving wood, plastic and other soft materials. At front we can see lots of interesting and shiny parts, stepper motors, uh, clamps, spindle motor, which is a 775 motor, so it is very easy to replace this spindle motor. Here is an engraving bit. Five of them are included uh, in package. In this review or test I will use only this bit because this is bit which is included in package. I ordered uh, also better engraving bits but uh, we will try them in some future video. On the back side uh, we can see this control board which is practically Arduino board powered by 80 Mega 328 with these uh, stepper motor drivers here is uh, this blue cable CNC is uh, connected to PC using this cable and here is also this uh, 24 volts power adapter which is also included in package I will not explain how to set up and install this uh, machine because on a Banggood page you will find all needed instructions, drivers and software that is needed. Installation uh, is very fast and very simple. Ok, let's test this device. Easiest way to engrave something is uh, using this great browser based application called Easel. It is very simple to use, I created this design and I will try to carve this design in uh, this piece of wood. I think uh, this is walnut, but I'm not sure. This will be a little wall mounted uh, key holder. Here I will uh, put little hooks which will hold my keys. Uh, here is name of my YouTube channel, feel free to subscribe. And here are these gears. I can set depth uh, of each element. Here are some carving settings. And when I'm done I need to click car. This program is so easy you can learn how to use in minutes. I need to adjust my zero point using these buttons. Don't forget to set your z-axis to barely touch wood and now I can start carve. This will be a long process, process. Uh, it will uh, took around uh, two and a half hours so let's speed up this video.
and after some time my project is finished not, not quite finished uh, you can always make it better with little cleaning and sanding of course after sanding it was a little better but I decided to paint it with wood paint I'm not sure is this was this a good idea after paint was dry I sanded it again and mounted these little hooks and here is final product maybe painting was not a good idea but mistakes makes us smarter that's it I'm very happy with this device and I can wait my new engraving bits thank you for your time if you like this video please subscribe and have a nice day